I wrote a horror story that has come true. Thomas Zane did the same in the 70s. He will go no further. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story. No one will survive. You knew Zane! Thomas Zane! You're the Lady of the Light in the song! He left something behind to help me. The clicker. Alan thought of this as he stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, the clicker in his hand. He took a deep breath and jumped. I can get to her now. I can finish this. How's it going, guys? Episode 6, Departure of Alan Wake. This is the last episode in the main line of the story. After this, there are two DLC chapters or episodes, which I'll also play through. This is uh, Saturday, October 7th, 7th day of Spooktober. It's a full week of Spooktober. And right now we're in a flashback of Alan Wake. I needed my sunglasses and um, to dull the pain. Two and years before he goes to Cauldron Lake. Time to get the sunglasses. He's a little hungover right now, so. Uh, we have to work with, work with him. Look now I could keep my eyes open without feeling like a vampire in the sun. I wasn't sure I'd make Time to get the drugs. Some painkillers. Gunk, gunk, gunk. The pills worked fast. The prospect of being awake started to seem bearable again. There was a message waiting. Oh, there's a message on the screen. You have one new message. Oh. Barry. Okay, let's watch the interview. So the guy on Alan Wake's right screen, all the way to the left, is Sam Lake. He was one of the heads of Remedy, and he actually did the original face capping of Max Payne in the first Max Payne game. Remedy's always been trying to uh, make their 3D models more lifelike, as you can kind of tell. Alan Wake here, voice actor guy there. Oops. Oh, there's Alice. Say anything stupid if that's what you want to know. Okay, Grumpy. You want She's gonna answer? yell at me. Are you gonna start with me about drinking now? You know what? Go back to sleep, Alan. Alan like ran around the whole room well, for this cutscene. I was angry because you said you'd be home at midnight and you showed up at 7 a.m. and passed out in mid-sentence. Now I'm over it. Are you angry? This goddamn tour. It's gotten out of hand. Oh, honey, it's all I think Alan's uh, tired of writing right now. Back to normal, and you can start writing again. I'm sorry, honey. Alan, you're not but we know he won't write for two you more years. To bed, huh? Yeah, uh, and that right, would honey. cost him. I'm sorry. Once this is over, let's go away together. A vacation, just you and me, some peace and quiet. I also have to put another correction to my correction. There is a David Bowie song in the game, although it wasn't the reason why this game got delisted. So, half right, half wrong. It's time to go to Cauldron Lake, save Alice, and beat the main game. Lake's got the clicker. I'm going back to the lake to finish this. I'm going to write an ending to the story in the manuscript on my own terms to make it all right. Why can't you just write it here? The last page is still in the typewriter. I need to read it first. Everything needs to be just right. Zane tried to cut some corners, and it didn't end well. Okay, ready when you are. I'm sorry, Sarah, but I need to do this alone. Barry, take her gun. Miss Weaver, close the door when I leave. Barry with his Christmas lights. Good luck, Al. See you later. When I got out, it was warm and sunny. I'd flicked the switch of the clicker. Had it done this? 
I didn't stop to question it. I had to take advantage of the sunlight to get to the lake. On Zeng's page, I'd stood on the rim of Cauldron Lake, about to use the clicker. That's where I was headed. We gotta go all the way over there. Yep, keep going. Back to where it all began. And this is gonna require driving, some running and walking through the woods. Cabins, birds, shadow in daylight. Shadow guys. Surrounded by the beauty of the Pacific uh, Northwest landscape. It was hard not to let the doubt beer, but I don't need that. I could still chalk everything up to a dream, a delusion. I had enough imagination to make up something like this. Having been in the cabin all this time, trapped in a story inside my head, gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed, there would be no way of knowing. I told myself it didn't really matter. My course was set. Energizer, they also branded all the batteries in this game. Verizon, I think, has a very, like, advertising in one of the DLC episodes. Whoa, whoa. That's the radio station that uh, we broke into. Or the ad for the uh, radio station, and then... Deerfest. Uh, okay. Yeah, we can't really get any further here. So we'll just cut through. Now it's become nighttime. Time to drive this car. I just want to stay to the main road right now. Use this, use cars as much as possible in this episode. Not only can we avoid the darkness, but we can also shine a light and then run him over. He's got a... Oops. We lost the uh, hood of the car, but we can still drive through. We're gonna have to cross the bridge. There's going to be more flying objects, but I want to pick up this flare first. Sorry about the death. Um, that shouldn't have happened. Uh, I rushed too much. See, because you got to navigate this bridge, but parts of the bridge are going to turn all shadowy and you can't really walk on them. The other parts are fine. It's just these the barrels that will fly at you. 
Where'd he go? There he is. Yeah, see right here. So I don't want to go on the far right, and then, as usual video games go, see the... I know I didn't kill that can. I believe this, hopefully this guy doesn't come, oh yeah it does. Thing went dark. Nice to see you too. Time to get in this muscle car and drive out to the next part. Self. I guess I ran the outran that monster truck. Now, oh. school bus got a time it just right. Let's see if I can't. What I'm gonna do, even though this doesn't make any sense, this. Back this car right into here. And then, so there's no possible way there's. Picking up the flares, not. I'm just gonna walk around. My flashlight burned some of it off. I'm not too worried.
crap, I'm only... There's a flashbang. Yeah, I was gonna say, I... I don't have to go back and get some ammo. Not what I was looking for, but I have no ammo whatsoever. Of course, yeah, that just re-triggers them. So I am down to three bullets. Kind of riding this truck, using as long as possible. Now the Verizon ad. point me to go this way but first I can't, okay I gotta find a way to open this gate hmm there might be a ch I can risk it and go for this because if I get it I can at least have some extra ammo I got one bullet left. Oh, this is great. This game, I know I'm, I know I'm out of ammo. There's nothing I can do about it. I just gotta get the lightning, burn this guy. Okay. So I hope none of these guys respond. Because if they do, I'm not going to make it very far. But. Alright. The only two pieces of ammunition I have are flares and flash, flash, flash bangs. Don't know why I couldn't say that. But, okay, yeah, that's just, so there's no point in, okay, shotgun, honey rifle, quick. Ah! Okay, we're, we're good to go here. Looking for any ammo. Yeah, I am getting low in batteries, so let's pick them up. See if there's. I only got eight shots with this, so. If I hit the button, it might trigger somebody, so I'll get the flashbangs, flare gun. I'm gonna use that only when absolutely necessary. I can probably jump out from here. Open the gate. Oh, the gate's open. Let's just get in and drive. Once the get in this different truck. Ramp over here. Keep the truck right there. So I need to get to the other side, but I'm gonna have to open up that. Oh, thought there was a flare for a second. Alan Wake is pretty talented. Oh, for a second there, I thought he could reload. 
Wall climbing the ladder. Gonna pick up my flares and flashbangs. Flare gun ammo. One, two, three, four. So I have to turn on that button before I can drive out the car. Gotta watch out for those exposed wires. Okay, so we got that tractor. Oh, I can't get in there. Really, the tractor just annihilated that truck. That stinks. But there's one right there. I'm not sure if... I'm sure there probably was a way, had I not positioned the truck that way, that I could have just opened up the gate and just snuck out with the truck. At least without killing those guys. But... It is what it is. At least the game doesn't punish you for, you know, punish you for, um, making a mistake like that. Hmm. I gotta chance it. Well, I guess not chance it, but... It's not a speed run, although I'd like to keep it under. When I told Barry my plan back in the well lit room. I'd acted as if I knew what I was doing. I didn't. I was operating on the shifting lodge. Getting closer to the lodge. I had to fight my way to the lake through the horrors of the night. Gotta follow the thing. Battered light switch imbued with childhood magic. I had to write a happy ending to a horror story. I had to save my wife from the dark. I really don't like this part. This pushing, because you gotta keep, even though you're past the opening, you gotta just keep lock, pushing until it locks in place. There's gonna be a barrage of guys coming here. As we get closer and closer to the lake, closer and closer to Jagger. I'm just gonna go in this room. There's Jagger. Kind of moving from room to room. Okay, so...
switch to the honey rifle. So I could use the searchlight. The thing is, those guys just take way too long. It's just... Plus I gotta push this so I didn't really want to jinx it. Because if they come from behind you, you pretty much, it stops and then you gotta... I'm stuck within the thing. Let me just. There we go. So, yeah, everyone's least favorite enemy is the birds. In this section, you're going to run this minecart. And you have. The only enemy that's there is the birds. Oh man, I'm glitched in the thing. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Hitting the checkpoint right now. Alright, cool, so we... Uh, that was close. Trying to stay in the light. Okay. Got a... Sure, there's another bird section coming up. I can feel it. I feel it in my bones. There they are. I probably should have landed a flare before I pushed this, but oh well. Just gotta keep mashing A. The birds are coming out from the tunnel. I almost went in that hole there. That was not, uh... Jagger must be a bird lady, cause, you know, all, all those birds. I messed up all my flares. Stay in the light for a couple seconds. Take inventory of the cabin. Need, need some batteries. I wish there was a flashbang. Uh, flashbangs and flares again. But I'm still progressing through the game. So we're almost at Cauldron Lake. Got through that bird section. It seems a little too quiet. Ah oh, man, we got those guys. Just 
just gonna keep moving forward here. Trying to stand here for a couple seconds, let my health get the half. At least half. Gotta go this way. There's a nice generator right here. One, two, three, four. Reload my gun. Every bullet's gonna count. She's creating a powerful tornado here. Ah! It kept rolling towards me down the hill. Okay, that shadow guy's still moving around. There he is. Dodge! No, 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 no. Come on, come on, Blake. Whew. I think there's two of them. Yes! Got three shots with the hunting rifle. And that's alright, because I got those two shadow guys out of the way. Probably should have went around the boat, but Okay. Almost at max health. One, two, three, four. Yeah, just restock everything. Uh, gonna have to go up that way. I'm yeah, up that way. See, I had shotgun rifle. Well, ammo, not hungry full ammo, so. Man, I timed that. Uh, I didn't time that very well. I'll say that. But 
I'm at the checkpoint right by it, so... I know it's coming. And this time I just avoided it. Stock up. Who switched the flares because I can utilize them to get at a jam. I mean, you can use the flashbangs to get out of jams with the flares if you need to. You know, you can't run away, whereas the flashbangs you can use. What I'm pretty much saying is... Needed to get the generator running. Okay... Generator somewhere around here. There's usually more flares and flashbangs, so therefore... It's... Okay... They're, they're more, more disposable. Okay, maybe it's over here... I'm, yeah, no, I'm messing something up here. Catch my breath. The wire's going that way. Okay, go back. Okay. Let's see what the f flare gun, flashbang, flashbang, flare gun. Okay, I'm good with the. F One, two, three. Oh yeah, see. We got a whole bunch of characters here. Call the elevator. Oh, well, that was luck. Oh, crap. Yeah. I was... I thought I was going to re-trigger those guys for a second, but... Yeah. I think we're... Getting there. We're going higher up the mountain. I know I can... No, wait, no! Get out of the... Oh, man. That was, a. Uh... Well, as you can see, the <laughs> elevator rotates you around. So, for such a way. Okay, so. I just gotta stand here. Let the elevator do its thing. Flare gun at 12. I'll pick up this manuscript page. Why not? I have most of them, but not all of them. Turn back now. Back now. I'm surprised the boat or anything didn't really fly out at me, but... Gotta watch out for those rocks. 
I think this is more of a cinematic part of the or interact inter interactic cinema okay time to destroy the tornado um. I believe all I have to do is shoot some flare or Probably could have rushed in there, but because I jumped down and lost half my health, or three quarters of my health. Uh, sorry about that. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go that far or not. I kind of forget that part, but well, at least we're back to nine flare shots. I guess I should have looked before I, uh... Time to jump! Oh! Almost got it down! Birds! And I think we got it. We had to feed the tornado. Dropping the flare gun. Taking out Jagger's tornado. Time to hit the clicker. Jump in there, finish the last page. He's king of the world. I think he was rethinking that jump. There he is, back with Alice. Darkness outside the window. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on. Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. So I'm gonna go to the fuse box. My fear? It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Where's the clicker? What did you do with it? Alan? You're scaring me now. Come back to bed. Have you taken your pills? Do you want me to call uh, that Come back to bed, Alan. Come back to bed, Tom. Flicker. <laughs> Burned away, evil Alice. Here comes Zane in his scuba diving suit. Very Big Daddy-esque.
Mr. Scratch definitely has a weird look on him, but it's a necessary double. All uh, Twin Peaks, uh, like their doubles, although I think a little different. So yeah, we got some. So yeah, if you you want to burn the words, Turn on the birds. It wasn't true. Nothing like that had ever happened. You're not my Barbara. Tom, I promise to be good. Please, I'm tiny, you naughty boy. I will help you write your masterpiece. I will love you forever. No, you're not Barbara Jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. You came back wrong. Your heart is filled with darkness. And uh, there is a big thermos. I, I got it already, but if big words of thermos that you can burn. So there's old Barbara Shadow Jagger. Now you will never get her back. I am much older than you. Older than your first work of art. Find a new face to wear. Uh, Someone else to dream me free. Oh, she, he's gonna click her. Now the big question is did Alan do it on his own or did Zane write that in there? And Alan had to come along to those predestined stuff. Either way, looks like Jagger uh, has been destroyed via the clicker. Now Alan Wake has to finish the story. Whereas Mr. Scratch is kind of in his place during the real time. I could feel Alice's presence close by. I understood what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to Departure. There's light and there's darkness cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. There's a long journey through the night back into the light. There's Alice, one up. She's trying to get out of the water.
Wake has released Sir from the darkness. But now he's still stuck there. Hope you all have enjoyed this playthrough. I'm going to still play through the two DLC parts. But yeah, that's been the full game. Episode by episode in different chunks. And now you're going to see Deerfest in its entirety. And I'll probably end the video when the credits start. Now you can see all the characters reunite some of the side guys good game I kind of wish you did get to interact with the town more uh, walk around it more than just the beginning and then the second to last episode oh she's got a lamp she, sh she knows what's up uh oh I think he got uh, controlled with the darkness Alright, there you go. I'll be back tomorrow for the first DLC uh, chapter of Alan Wake. Until next time, bye.